For today's video I had something different in mind, compared to the last two days anyway. After a couple of blocks though I felt this pain in my foot caused by a wrong move during dance lessons this morning. My original idea required a lot of walking, so I was left without a plan. Right then and there a bus stopped by my side, and without any clue where it was heading I spontaneously got out. To this moment I still don't know how the bus system exactly works. There are a bunch of handwritten names that don't mean anything to me on the front window. No maps, no bus stops. But for the people around me it seemingly works fine. For the purpose of exploration and the experiment, I decided to sit down for a while. Seeing the cityscape change, people leaving and entering the vehicle can be quite interesting if you pay the price of attention. In Mexico City, the neighborhoods can change quite quickly, only in a few blocks. That goes for the atmosphere too. After a while, I figured it was far enough. I had to get back somehow anyway. Since I didn't understand how to stop the bus, I decided to get off wherever the next passenger would. At some random place. surprised by the buzzing life on the streets wherever you go. Almost everywhere you lay your eyes on, there's something going on, there's some form of interaction. It took me a while to get accustomed to how social these people really are over here. It is a joy and an honor to be able to walk through this, and I can very much recommend you to experience it for yourself. I really felt like a small particle in this huge metropolis. Locals claim to house 28 million people, including the unregistered. Where everybody has their own story, is their own center. The only thing I knew was that the bus was heading east, a direction I never went from my workspace. Being just somewhere with all this around me was a four peso surprise. I always look for this tall tower called Torre Latino Americana, one of the city landmarks. And as a bonus, I met some very nice people on the way who cared to share their story with me. That was nice. I'm happy I didn't take a bus back. This is why I really really love to walk. But still, I'm really happy I got on this bus today. Seeing it departing again with all these passengers, with their own stories, their own centers, disappearing into the city, I'll probably never see them again. <laughs> <laughs>